bribing a district judge named Cornelius Holden. Is that correct? Sal Marcano spent a lot of money getting Holden in his pocket. A lot of money. Judges like that don't come cheap. And with Holden out of the picture, Sal had to find someone else to legalize gambling. And that person was State Senator Walter Jacobs. That's right. You had one fucking job, Lou. Now it's to keep holding him one goddamn piece to left in that room. What was I supposed to do? He wouldn't listen, Sal. It ain't my fault. Ah, uh, nothing's ever your goddamn fault. I swear, if you wasn't my brother, I'd clip you myself. Now listen here. I know a guy, a state senator named Jacobs. He's on the Revenue and Fiscal Affairs Committee. <laughs> Has a lot of influence. Can we get to him? Already have. He has a thing for fucking on women who ain't his wife. I don't want to twist this guy's balls out of the gate, you understand? We need to be smart about this. Yeah, 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 of course. Uh, how about I throw him a fundraiser on the riverboat? Show him a real nice time. Get him weighed, all that shit. This goddamn casino got me tapped, you understand? This goes down to shit or we're fucked, all of us. Well, I'll pick the guests myself. Make sure they know what's what. Then we'll take a nice long cruise down the bayou, get them all liquored up. Once he sees that payday, Jacob is gonna do whatever we want. <laughs> Lou Marcano knew everyone. I mean, politicians, merchants, lawyers, bankers. He insisted on being called Uncle Lou and was basically the Santa Claus of the French ward. According to the police reports, Mr. Marcano and Mr. Jacobs were killed during a fundraiser on a riverboat. Thing about the bayou is it's a very big place. You could blow the living shit out of everything in sight and no one would even notice. Upstairs. You're fan out. Watch the rest of the boat. This sure shit wasn't an accident. Huh? Cowboy up. Leave it huh? to me!
That's far enough, you wop asshole! What the fuck, Lou? Take another step, me bitch. Can you think I give a shit about some politician? Please! Please, I, I don't even know what's going on! I don't want your money. I want you to send a message to your brother. Yeah. Anything. Oh, just say it. Just say it. <laughs> Lord Almighty. in a fiery explosion aboard a riverboat. Local businessman Louis Marcano also lost his life, along with dozens of other wealthy donors there to attend a political fundraiser. When Lincoln left his gutted body on a statue commemorating Andrew Jackson, people were horrified. I mean, how could that be anything but a political statement? Lincoln once told me he couldn't tell any other cheat. That the world doesn't work that way. <laughs> I spent the better part of 40 years trying to prove him wrong. But I was just lying to myself. Look at how we treat each other. Compassion is a sign of weakness. But greed is a virtue. The poor is considered morally corrupt while every excess of the powerful is celebrated. We sent kids off to die. For what? So someone can make a few bucks? Lincoln was right. He was always right. <laughs> there ain't never gonna be another Dr. King or a Bobby Kennedy. But there's always going to be another Sal Marcano, another Sammy Robinson, another Lincoln Clay. We are cruel and wicked people. Get lost on your way over? There's no one left to stand in our way. We run this city now. So far, you making it damn clear that you and I are gonna run this town together. But there's no such thing as too much power, not in this business. This district needs to stay between us, just like the others. Don't know why you kept me at arm's length so far, but you can turn the shit around between us with this part of the city. Shit, son, I could have secured those rockets as well as anyone, probably better. You chose me to run the day-to-day -day for the last piece of the city, and I expect to be running it here as well. It's been a long road. The Haitians will run this part of the city. We got a lot to work with here, brother. This is real good. <laughs> I, I have Wade Fagan Lincoln will have killed us all by now. 
Were we done here? Taking the city away from Markana and doing it without killing each other? We gotta be proud of that. I'll admit it. I had my doubts, but no more. You came through just as you promised. And I'm lucky to be a part of it. Holy Christ! How the fuck did we make it through this shite in one piece? I thought for a certain Scarlet I'd have his throat slit by now. You did a bang-up job here, lad. A goddamn dream come true. Can't wait to see where we go from here. There's one thing I learned in life is that things almost never work out the way you'd like. You gotta roll with it. So, this is me rolling. We're living proof that the ways of Marcano, the lying, the backstabbing, the cheating, don't need to run in that direction. Those ways are as dead as he is.